Chapter on Entering the Haram and Mecca Without Assuming Ihram And Ibn Umar entered without Ihram. But the Prophet, peace be upon him, ordered those intending to perform Hajj or Umrah to assume Ihram. But he did not mention the woodcutters and the like, that is, those who frequent the sanctuary of Mecca. Narrated Ibn Abbas, may Allah be pleased with them, the Prophet, peace be upon him, fixed the Hulayfa as the Miqat, the place for assuming Ihram, for the people of al Madinah, and Qarn al-Manazil, for the people of Najd, and Yalamlam, for the people of Yemen. These Mawaqid are for those people, and also for those who come through these Mawaqid, from places other than the above mentioned, with the intention of performing Hajj and Umrah. And those living inside these Mawaqid can assume Ihram from the place where they start. Even the people of Mecca can assume Ihram for Hajj only from Mecca. Narrated Anas bin Malik, may Allah be pleased with him. Allah's Messenger, peace be upon him, entered Mecca in the year of its conquest, wearing an Arabian helmet on his head. And when the Prophet, peace be upon him, took it off, a person came and said, Ibn Khafal is holding the covering of the Kaaba, taking refuge in the Kaaba. The Prophet, peace be upon him, said, Kill him. Footnote A Muslim is not allowed to cover his head. The fact that the Prophet's head was covered while entering Mecca indicates that he had entered Mecca as a non muhrim Footnote Allah's Messenger, peace be upon him, on conquering Mecca, forgave all the people of Mecca except some persons who had committed nasty crimes against Islam and Muslims. <laughs>